welcome to my channel for those who are here for the first time welcome welcome to the family my name is Andy Swamtembu aka Andy Velase and um, welcome to my channel and for my returning subscribers hello baby hello family I hope that you are okay you are good and thank you for coming back to watch another video bye your fave so today guys i'm at work um just having a spend the day with me video uh vlog type of thing i'll be showing you um the x-ray department because we don't really have that much patience on weekends so basically i want to show you where i work and day in the life of a student radiographer okay so anyway guys i am so sleepy right now i did not get a wink of sleep because i just did my hair it is so painful it is so painful but anyway we move i bought myself an energy drink right now because i will not survive this day without one at all so yeah see you guys in a minute okay guys i don't know if you can hear me um, over my mask but anyway I'm going now for a portable in one of our intensive care units um, I'll just show you the portable machine just now but yeah so that's when you take a portable machine x-ray machine to the wards okay, sorry about that guys um, anyway I was saying that that's when you take a portable machine to the ward because the patient can't come down to the x-ray um, department yeah so I'll show you just now okay so guys this is a portable machine I can't really stop and show you guys because I have to get to the ward but yeah this is what it looks like um, let me just stop here and pass it quickly and show you so that's what it looks like it's basically a small car and this is the tube which um, is like where your x-rays come from and then you get these things here detectors which you put under the patient for whatever uh, procedure you're doing and then that will um, and then that will basically um, give you your image so yeah can't really talk in like scientific language because some of you guys wouldn't be able to understand me but yeah so i'm about to get to the ward so i have to go now but anyway see you later okay guys i'm done now with the patient uh so now i need to take that detector that i showed you the square box thing and go and process it downstairs sorry about that noise and I need to go and I need to go and process it downstairs in our x-ray room um, I'll show you the process I can't show you the image that I took however because the patient's information will be there and and um, since we have pop here now it's kind of gonna be very unethical of me to show you my patient's information and even without popia i still wouldn't be allowed to show you so yeah just gonna show you equipment that's it okay guys now we're in the processing room i'll show you how what i do I can't show you the computer i'll just show you when i put in the detector into uh this machine into this machine which reads the detector and then will show me an image on this computer here so first you scan there let's make that sound and then come and put it in this here see that tells you that it's reading it there then when it's ready this will be blue okay guys uh so there's no one in here right now so I'll just show you quickly before anyone sees me I'm not sure if I'm allowed to do this but anyway yeah I'll just show you our x-ray rooms quickly so this is the back where we work from this is to set your exposures where 
you sit for whatever you're doing example a chest you sit for a chest you know this computer is where you enter the patient this is where we have all our patients names and all of that and then this is another part so for this is a for this room so this is how it looks this is an x-ray bed you put in the detector in that drawer there and yeah this is for oxygen if the patient's coming with an oxygen uh, tank and if we can't put it there on the bed we have to plug it in to this thing here and then that's the erect backing so that's where we have our detector if we're doing anything that is for a patient that's standing and then we'll also have direct where the patient will be sitting or on the bed and then we'll have the detector directly on the patient's anatomy yeah and basically this room is exactly the same so yeah so this is our tube that's our tube this is for standing um, procedures and this is for supine or lying down the bed the same thing and then the chairs for when maybe you're doing x-rays for a hand and elbow for arm yeah and then these are our lead protections just to protect the patients from radiation um yeah that's a drip stand and yeah that's also another lead protection yeah so that's basically what an x-ray room looks like Okay, so this is the screening room it's basically almost the same as x-rays but then this will show you things in much deeper depth okay so this is the computer as well where we enter the patient it, you know everything that's the cpu for the computer um yeah and then chair for a patient then that's a screen uh, you put that up for um when the patient is changing or something then this is uh how we move that machine there press these buttons you know to move this and also to move the bed so the patients usually are lying down or if we're doing a barium swallow then the patient will be um will move the bed to stand upright like that and that computer will show us um the image you're getting from that there yeah so that's basically it that light is for when we're doing procedures that need a light and yeah that's it and this is a x-ray uh, viewing box so when they were still doing x-ray films they would put up the film here and then you'd be able to see it and light up and you'd be able to see your x-ray properly this is just a sink yeah and yeah guys that's basically the whole x-ray department and then we have so, and then we have our uh, duty room which is where we sit uh, when we have our lunch or snack or breakfast whatever and then uh, we also have the reception which I can't show you because there's people there and they might not like that and then we have our doctor's rooms where the radiologist uh, sits and they will look at the images and give results basically so what they see on the image I just wanted to show you this this is our old screening room so that machine where I said you move this one is like the same but then now it's the side so you don't have to stand that side and this side guys it's lead painted so lead is like a protection from radiation so that's how it looks see how different it is from the other one this is why this one is really old like really old so now we use this room as a room for changing for our qualifiers and fourth years uh, for when they go and do COVID patients. For when they do COVID patients in the wards um, or here in our rooms. Yeah, I am not qualified to do COVID patients as yet. So I don't. Thank God. But yeah. So yeah, guys. So these are our changing rooms here. I just need to take this away. This is a portable ultrasound machine. Okay. Yeah. And then I'm just gonna steal. This is a ultrasound room here. This is where we 
do all the ultrasounds and changing rooms, bathroom. If anyone knows, tell me why this is important. Okay, this is another ultrasound room. Yeah. Okay guys, I just came back from another portable, so on weekends that's what we do the most, um, rather than x-rays in our x-ray department, we do more portables. I'm sweating because the doctor is there, I'm afraid of doctors, like I can't with doctors. So, yeah, there's just too much pressure, and yeah, so now I'm driving our old machine. It's so hard to drive, oh my god, like it's so stiff. <sighs> yeah, it just goes its own way, Jay. So hard, like, I'm literally using all of my strength. See my veins popping. Oh my god. Okay, I can't push this thing with one hand, so I'm gonna have to. Yeah. Okay, I'm back. So. I'm about to have my lunch the cheap cafe is closed today so I had to buy from the expensive one <laughs> uh, I just spent so much on lunch but anyway I'll show you just now what I'm eating um, I want to show you our duty room as well I don't know if that's necessary but yeah I don't know if you can hear me here because like, I have an airpod on I don't know if it's communicating <laughs> but yeah I'll show you what I'm eating and then I'll show you okay first I'll show you the duty room and then I'll show you what I'm eating so. okay so this is our duty room don't mind our old couches yeah and there's a small couch the side and we have a TV there, and that door is going through to MRI this side, and yeah, that's where we charge our phones, we have telephones, yeah, that's it basically, and then I'll show you what I'm eating. Okay, so this is my lunch, uh, day two. So they bring you whatever sauces you ask for, so I ask for tomato sauce and Tabasco because this one sachet is not enough for me child. I eat a lot of tomato sauce so yeah. So I bought burger and chips. The chips are so nice guys, they are so nice, I swear to god. And then I bought a milkshake, this is their iced coffee milkshake yeah and that's basically what i'm having for lunch so yeah guys i'm gonna eat now and then get back to work because i was waiting for a patient for a lumbar spine x-ray from er but they hadn't sent the patient yet. i don't know if she's there yet but yeah well i'll be eating so if she comes someone else will have to do it <laughs> yeah mini mukbang that looks so good mm, that is so nice ASMR <laughs> okay. let me go That is so nice. Mm. Oh, 
that is so nice why have I never had this thing before but anyway see you later just wanted to do a quick ASMR No, this one not crunchy. Okay, let's try this one. Okay. Mmm. Update. I'm still at work. Only leaving at 6 o'clock. And I'm the only one here without a car. So I have to go take a taxi. <laughs> oh, what is life? I'm so bored now. We're busy with patients. And now it's just quiet. So we shall see what happens in the next. What time is it even now? In the next four, four hours. It's two now. So in the next four hours we'll see what happens but yeah i'm charging my phone let me show you connect to the charger here because i need to charge so that my battery doesn't finish on me yeah so i'll talk to you guys later I just want to show you guys the CT room. I hope I don't get in trouble for this, but anyway. So this is where we do CT scans. That's the CT machine. Here is the bed. Yeah. Yeah, there is a complete like stealing to show you guys <laughs> let me just get my milkshake i'll see if i can show you mri okay so this is the mri department there's the big machine there can't i don't want to put on the light this side because i'm scared child but just came back from another portable no child i'm tired <laughs> i just want to go home and sleep i bought some pills so hopefully they'll help me to sleep today because honey i suffered yesterday I suffered for 19 years it's time for me to sleep okay okay i need to pee so let's go pee Okay, I just need to show you the spot, guys. It's not so cool. No lot. Bathroom selfies. <laughs> Hi, guys. So I'm back home. I just came back from work. I changed into my PJs. I'm so tired. I'm so exhausted and hungry. Just gonna warm up my burger from earlier and then I'm gonna eat and then I'll probably just sleep. I'll take my pills and sleep because I know that I won't sleep without those pills. And yeah, I'm just exhausted. Anyways, I just came to end of the vlog. Thank you so much for watching. If you're watching my videos for the first time, please do subscribe and watch more videos on my channel. There's so many you can choose from. Like, comment down below on what else you'd like to see. If you have any questions on radiography, please do comment down below or DM me. I will put my Instagram handle here and my Twitter handle as well. And then you can just throw a dm and i'll answer any question that you have and to my existing subscribers thank you guys for coming back i hope you enjoyed this video i hope it was to your liking to your expectations 
and yeah i'll see you on the next video